Rev up your engines! It's time for the Scotty Kilmer Channel. Today I'm going to show you how to fix a car that won't go into gear when you push down on the clutch. It just won't go in gear. Now in this case, the clutch pedal is going way to the floor and there's hardly any pedal left. So we're going to check the hydraulics first. Now here's the clutch master cylinder reservoir and that goes down to the clutch master cylinder here. But you can't check anything here because it's all sealed. So we'll go under the dash and check up on the top here with our hands. And as you can see on my finger here, there's fluid leaking. It's hard to see inside there, so here's a new master cylinder. The fluid is leaking around here, which means the seal is gone and we need a new master cylinder. So the first thing we're going to do is remove the line here, which is a 10 millimeter bolt. But it's very hard to get to, so we need one of these flare wrenches that fits on it. It's a 10 millimeter flare wrench and we can loosen it up. Uh. Then the line just pops up. And now comes the fun part. We have to go inside and there's no filming room there. What we're basically doing is we have to take this nut off so we can take this off of the clutch pedal and take these two bolts and remove it. You can see the bolts are up here and the other bolt is inside here. You can't fill it very well, but you just have to reach inside and unbolt that stuff. Now as those are hard to get to, I use a ratchet. I use one of these extensions that has a wiggling part on it so it can go at an angle and you can get the bolts off easier. And off it comes. Then with a big wiggling, the whole thing comes out. Yeah. Then you get your new master cylinder, put the hose on it, and slide it back down in the hole. Real fun. You have to fish the line on and start it up so it gets nice and tight. <coughs> and you want to be very careful with a little 10 millimeter wrench because if you cross strut it, you're going to have a really hellacious problem. So be real careful wiggling and start it up. Once it starts, it's easy, but you got to start it smooth. Then you go back under the dash and tighten up the bolts. Uh. Then fill up the clutch master cylinder with brake fluid. Then we need to bleed the air out. So first we crack the line a little. And that's so air can come out here. Then we use a giant screwdriver, stick it on a clutch pedal, and pull the seat forward. That'll hold it in place. Then we tighten the line up so it's sealed. Then we put the seat back and the clutch comes back up. Then we crack the line again and repeat the procedure three or four times to get all the air out of the system. And now it goes into gear and away we go. So the next time your car won't go into gear, why not fix it yourself? If you've got any car questions, just visit the Scotty Kilmer channel. And I'll answer them as soon as I'm done moving this house.